wasn't me. It was me, Sammy. I broke my piggy bank. It's time to buy a new smartphone. Mine isn't functioning anymore. Shoo, when did you manage to save so much money? I was saving change from shopping, but now I need to count all this. Can you help me? Oh, sure. It's a very pleasant task. a special counting machine like they have in the banks. Uh, Sam, where are you going? What's your guess? Sam, you're a genius! Duh. Hi, guys! All the greatest human inventions began from a simple wheel, and our machine is not an exception. And who invented the wheel, Sue? Oh, well, it was invented thousands of years ago. Thousands of years?! Guys, do you know why ancient people needed the wheel? Write in the comments what you think about it. Sam, can you help me make two more wheels like this? Sure, Sue. I am a cardboard master after all. <laughs> Better say a cardboard gluing master. Exactly. Next, we'll need puddles like this. They're made of two layers of regular cardboard and one layer of cover cardboard. Sam, how's it going with the wheels? All good, but I can't understand why you need three of them. Uh, to catch! These are future digital screens for units, tens, and hundreds. And these are gears. I read that there are some plant hoppers that have gears on their legs. Is this true, Sue? Yes, Sammy, it is. With such leg mechanisms, the nips of these plant hoppers can jump very fast and at long distances. Shoo! Shoo! Did I do good? Oh, you glued it so nicely! Hole to hole! You forgot to cut the gear for the third wheel, Susie! Here, we will need these small wooden pieces, Sammy. The parts should be placed strictly between the numbers. I thought that if we have gears, then there should be a switch. Sam, you're thinking like an engineer mechanic. These are some great parts from Cover Cardboard. I will go it, I will. Tap, 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 tap. I wish I could glue a new smartphone for you like this. Or... No, 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 no. We won't make any smartphones from cardboard. I'll just buy a new one. A high resolution camera, and tons of gigabytes of memory. Two. I was thinking that technology is developing so fast. True, Sammy. And what are you worried about? What if the machines take over? What if we serve them and not the other way? <laughs> I don't think that'll happen. At least not in the nearest future. Yeah, sure. Today it's Roomba and tomorrow the owner of our house. Look, Sammy, do you really think that such a cute mechanism can do any harm? I'm not sure, Susie. I'll watch it. Sue is preparing the other parts for our craft, and I will make a surprise for her. Ugh. I'll glue the future body for our machine. I'm pretty sure that this is the best industrial design. Whoa, when did you manage to make such an awesome body? It didn't take me long. And uh, what's that? New parts, of course. But there is one special feature. These wooden sticks. They will become the axis for our small wheels. Here's more cover cardboard, and just a tiny little bit of a regular one. Cover cardboard is very durable, so our parts will serve longer. Sam disappeared again! Ugh. Huh. I better go drink some hot chocolate. Lunch time! By the way, first MDF material, similar to the one we use in our craft, was invented because of lunch. Maybe I'll invent something too. The inventor left for lunch and turned off the wood shaving steam press. But it was broken, so the steam continued to flow. 
That's how a very solid material was created. Now you see, Celia can't skip lunch. <laughs> right, Sammy. Check out the result. And if I hadn't left, you wouldn't have done so great. Guys, what do you like to eat for lunch? Tell us in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to the news of our channel. We'll assemble it all together. It's important to go nice and slow here. I'm totally puzzled. What are you actually doing? This part doesn't look very friendly. <laughs> this is a very useful part. With its help, we can reset the numbers on the coin counter. I still don't get it. Sammy, don't rush. You'll see in a moment. This looks like the Decepticon with scary tentacles! Our machine will have makings of artificial intelligence. It will count coins on its own and show the numbers on the display. Did you say artificial intelligence? It means it'll think, and this means we're in danger! Sammy, you're an alarmist. Better pass me that hook. If I were you, I'd be careful with any declarations. Here you go. <laughs> Sammy, don't run away. I also need rubber bands. Uh, I didn't know how many I need, so I took all of them. <laughs> As always, I needed just one. We secure it like this. And the last part is this one. It consists of covered cardboard and one hair clip that I don't need. We'll glue it here. Sue, our super machine needs a test drive. What if you mix something up? Hmm, okay, let's try. One, two, three, uh -huh. da, 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 ten. Okay, and uh, now let's reset. <laughs> oh, now we can count tons of coins! <laughs> and now we will assemble the heart of our coin counter. Uh -huh. All right. Mm -hmm. Sammy, I need a battery. Huh, battery? I saw it somewhere. I'll go look for it. In the meantime, we'll connect the wires like this. Terminals and the switch to the motor and the battery. The circuit is complete. Shoo! Shoo! Mission impossible! I can't find the battery! I believe in you. Look in the closet. Guys, be very careful with the soldering tool or ask an adult to help you. Oh, what's all this? Shoo, this is all I found. Sammy, you know that's not what I need. Please search some more. Guys, let's support Sam. Give him a thumbs up. Just a little bit left. This motor will bring the coin counting mechanism to life. Oh, Sam, super timing. Look what I've got. Let's test our mechanism. Wow, so this is real magic. No magic, my friend. Just science and technology. We have the two best parts of the craft ahead. Assembling and decoration. Sue, are we decorating something? <laughs> no, Sam, it's too early. I knew that was gonna work. I hoped that you'd help me cut out several parts from cardboard. So then, you are so cunning, but I know that you can't do without me. Sure thing, Sammy. And meanwhile, I'll attach the motor to its designated place. A couple more parts. And look, the coin will drop here. The motor rotates this wooden part. One side of it turns the counter and the other pushes the coin out. Whoa, perfect timing! Oh, your intelligence is creating artificial intelligence! Isn't that ironic, Sue? Can't argue there. Oh, you glued it so fast! Are you sure you're not a robot? <laughs> no, Sammy. Check out what we have here. Hooray! Finally decorating. This is my shining moment. Decorate to smack it, guys! <laughs> Oh, Sammy, shall we count how much money I saved? Now we definitely won't lose the count. Guys, 
Did you like our high cardboard technology? Give a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell button. Bye-bye. And don't trust robots. Oh, let's see. Where is it? Ugh. Oh, come on. Where's that note? <sighs> right. <sighs> Let's see. Um. So, what's up with all this mess, huh? I'm just looking for one important note. Yeah, and you had to make a mess on the table for that? <sighs> what's this weird piece of paper? <gasps> oh! There it is. I need to check quickly. No, but what about... Susie? <sighs> uh, yes. So, uh -huh. what's this? I haven't seen such things in our house before. I bought it in a vending machine at the library. I had to eat something for lunch. I had little time. <sighs> a real vending machine? Uh -huh. oh, I only know cardboard ones. If we make here... Sue, uh, Sue, I know these machines give out the items, but uh, uh, how do they sort the coins, huh? Uh, huh? Sam. Uh, oh, I know. There are little people inside. They take the coins and they give the items, right? What? Oh, like uh, in the Men in Black movie? I remember that, sure, but vending machines don't work like that. Then how? Well, you already saw how a machine gives out candies and chocolates, even soda. So, I only need to show you how such machines sort coins. Come! Yay! We're going to learn something new again! Hi, guys! Today, we're going to make a coin sorting machine. From metal? Uh, no. From plastic? No, Sammy, from cardboard. But a real vending machine isn't made of cardboard. Yes, sure, but it's not that important to understand how it works. Uh, well, fine, I can agree with that. Are you gonna help me? I need to think on that. Oh, <laughs> well, all right, think. What are you making now? I'm making a pass system for the coins so that each coin will fall into a certain compartment. Look, this will be the first phase. To make sure the coins pass one by one. I need to measure here. Huh. Yes. <laughs> See? Two coins won't pass. I can see that. Continue. Sammy, at least select three coins for me. 25, 5, and 1 cent. Yes! I'm going to need them now. And I'll set this piece aside. Hey, Sammy, where are the coins? Here they are! Now I understand why they need to be sorted. It's hard to find the one you need. Phew! That's right. Now, can you imagine how many coins a vending machine in a crowded place processes in a day? For example, in a library or in the subway? You can't do it without automation. So, it's better to do some work once, and then it goes smoothly afterwards. Look, each coin will have its own little window, and they will fall into their own little compartments. Perfect. Little windows? Oh, make them with your signature trick. Well, all right, and hop! Voila! Now let's glue the sidewalls to make sure the coins don't roll away. <laughs> I still don't get it. How will it work? Here, look, see? Only the coins of a suitable size can fall into the opening. Oh, now I'm starting to get it! Yes, awesome! Well, all right, Sue. I understand how the coins will be sorted, but, uh, how will they get into the coin tunnel? We won't push them with our hands, right? Oh, no, no, Sammy. The motor will help us with that. We're going to connect it to the battery with the help of wires. Guys, be very careful with the wires. You'd better ask an adult to help you with this stage. And to make sure we can turn the motor on and off, 
We'll connect this switch to it. Right, this wire goes here and that one there. Ah, done! Now we only need to glue a small screw to the motor to create the effect we need. There. What effect? A vibration effect. Look! Oh, <laughs> it's jumping wild! So, will this help the coins get into the sorting tunnel? <laughs> That's right. Let's hide our mechanism into a cardboard case to keep it safe from damage. We'll glue the motor here. Carefully. Watch out for the wires. And the battery goes here. And walls all around. Yes, Sammy. Thanks. Huh. And you've been saying that I'm not helping you. You had a piece with a hole in it. I removed it as a faulty one. Oh no, Sammy. It should have a hole. It's for the switch. So please don't throw that piece away. Here. Um, look. It fits perfectly. Mike, this. And we'll cover it carefully. Okay, done. Sue, Sue. This has to be the trash, right? Weird pieces, leftovers, I guess. Sam, Sam, wait! No, these are very important. We need to set our case with the motor on these legs to allow the coins to fall down. See? Oh, uh, oh, I'm just out of shape. Confusing trash with parts. Oh. Cheer up, Sammy, and bring the rest of the pieces, all right? But don't throw anything away. Will do! And we have made this structure. We only need to add the walls. Cardboard pieces delivery! Oh, wonderful, Sam! Now we're going to make the finishing piece. Which piece? Well, the containers where the coins will fall in. Vending machines store all the coins separately to give out the change very quickly. Oh, I see. Tell me, Susie, do all vending machines sort coins by size? Well, that's the basic principle. But modern machines can distinguish coins according to the metals in them and even the images on them to exclude any errors. But our sorting machine is a very basic one. So it'll sort coins only according to its size. <laughs> oh, but it's still really awesome! Oh, Sammy, could you bring me the stickers for our containers? Just a moment! And I'll connect our sorting mechanism. I'll be quick. Ta-da! It's not ta-da without decor. You know that. Oh. Move aside, make room for the professional decorator. Sammy, maybe I should do it. You know, neatly. Well, fine. I did a lot today already. All right. 50 cents, 25, 10, and 1 cent. And on off for the switch. Is it ta-da now? Yes! Ta-da! <laughs> Start the machine! Let's place several handfuls of coins in here. Perfect. And click. Wow. They flow like a river! Oh yeah! Look, look! They're sorted correctly! That's awesome! Now all the coins in the house will be sorted out perfectly. Will you keep it under control? Yes, ma'am. Will do, ma'am. <laughs> well done. Guys, was it interesting for you to learn how coin sorting happens? Give a thumbs up if it was. And subscribe to the channel to learn more interesting facts about our world. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.